Hey guys, I'm Owl and welcome to Jurassic Heart. This is a game that is online, it's free to play, and I will put a link in the description, but basically, um, it's a sim date game where you date a dinosaur. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Startle. English, please. Please enter your name. My name is Owl, but there's no music at the oh. Never mind. All right, it's time to go buy a ukulele with Tyra. Con. All right, maybe I should buy him a meal too. I'm the reason why his old one is broken, after all. Oh, the ukulele! <laughs> I thought I bet like I broke his his meal, like I, or whatever. Come to think of it, isn't this going to be the first time I meet him outside of school? <gasps> now that makes me nervous. Better make sure I don't look funny. Let's see, which hair clip should I go for? Usual fossil shaped hair clip, treble clip shaped hair clip, meat on the bone shaped <laughs> Well, since we're gonna go buy a ukulele, let's get the treble clef one. We're going to a music instrument store. Might as well dress for the occasion. Yeah. All set. Now I better hurry and go meet him at the station. Oh boy. I'm gonna go with some toast in my mouth. Okay, there he is. Hello, Tyra Kun. Did I make you wait? Not at all, but I've just got here as well. Hey, by the way, that hair clip. Uh, oh, this. Well, since we're going to buy ukulele, music related stuff, you know? Is it weird? N not at all. I think it really suits you. Oh, it's so cute. Really, thank you. Looks like he likes it. So, ready to go get your new ukulele? Yes, let's go. Are, are we gonna go? <laughs> Yay! Alright, let's get you a nice ukulele. Wow, you really are fired up about this, aren't you? Tyrakin, I'm the one who put you into that situation with the music club. Of course I feel bad. So choose whatever you like. It's on me. I yeah, about that. I know how you feel, but I want you to know that it wasn't your fault. You didn't know that I'd panic in front of people. I, I did, and I dropped my old ukulele, breaking it into pieces as a result. Wow, that's a piece of shit ukulele you had there. Which wouldn't happen if I didn't force you to play in front of them. But you didn't. I chose to do it myself. If you were forcing me, I wouldn't be here. Really, I f I'd feel terrible if you'd have to pay for something I did. So just let me pay for it, okay? It's hard to tell from his face, but he sounds really upset. Yeah, no, no kidding, it's hard to tell from his face. He's a fucking dinosaur! What should I do? Uh... Pay half. You're right. I should have thought about how you feel. I'm sorry, Tyrakun. It's alright. I'm glad you understand. Still, I feel- really feel like it's part of my fault. So, how about we meet halfway? Both of us pay half the price of the ukulele we choose. So? Ukulele will be ours, not just mine or yours. Our ukulele? Of course. This doesn't mean I'll play it, just because I have no idea how to play one. I'm more of a singer. So, you have to let me sing along to whatever you play. No negotiation. Sure, I'll just play a song you don't know. Wh what? Then I'll just sing a random song along anyway. <laughs> For some reasons, I knew you'd say that. Anyway, our ukulele. I like that. Thank you, all but Well, our ukulele won't choose itself, will it? Let's go find one. Okay! Yay! We spend our time looking for ukulele that we both like. After looking through the store, you finally find a solid wood one. I think the size is a bit too small for him. But hey, as long as he's happy with it, right? After that, we go to the park and have some grilled chicken there. Tyrakan must really love them. He eats them really fast. Okay. Oh, I, I didn't realize it's evening already. Neither did I. I guess it's time to go home, huh? I'll walk you to the station. Thanks, Albert. That's really nice of you. You're welcome. Well, hmm? What's wrong? May I ask what you're gonna do after this? Oh, well, gonna go home and play, um, 
really weird sim games on the computer? Yeah. <clears throat> Not much really. Not much really? Why? Well, I was wondering if you could stay a bit longer? I have something to talk to you about. Of course! R really? Thank you. So, what do you want to talk about? Well, it's about my fear of performing in front of many people. I never told you this, but I was never like this. Up until junior high school, that is. I see. What happened? Well, when my body was still small, it was easy for me to pick up a ukulele. During junior high school, I started growing bigger, and things weren't the same as they used to be. During a concert at the school event, there was an accident. Someone tripped and hit me, making me drop my ukulele. I tried to pick it up, but I couldn't. Oh no. Not with my tiny arms like these. Tyrakin. I was struggling, trying to pick it up, but I only made things worse. The audience started laughing. Giggles grew into hysterical laughters. It was horrible, to say the least. My friend helped me pick my ukulele up, but it was far too late. I couldn't move a single muscle. I just stood there, frozen. Ever since that day, I, every time I performed in front of many people, I couldn't help but ask myself these questions. Will I drop my instrument again? What would happen if I did? Will they laugh at me? I'm so sorry. I should have told you this before I agreed to perform. No, you're really brave, you know? Knowing that you're scared, but you still tackle the problem head on? I admire you for that. Thank you, Al, but it's really weird because when I perform in front of you, none of those thoughts ever crossed my mind. Somehow, you're special. Hehehe. <laughs> Maybe it's because there was no human at your concert. That's why me as an audience didn't remind you of anything from that event. Maybe. But whatever it is, I'm thankful for it. I'm glad that it's you. No, Tyrakin is making me blush. Thank you for sharing this with me, Tyrakin. And thank you for listening. And for giving me courage. You know, I just got an idea. If you're worried about picking up your ukulele, I'll do it. Huh? I'll do it. When you perform, I'll be there. And if you drop the ukulele, I'll dive in. Grab it, and throw it right back at you. That's crazy! Well, maybe the throwing part is. The point is, you don't have to worry. I'll help. You can count on me. I'll but... Thank you. That means a lot to me. Just be careful and don't step on me when I'm picking up your ukulele, okay? Uh, of course, I won't step on you. I know you won't. I was just messing with you. You know what? We haven't actually tried that new ukulele of ours. How about a song before we go home? H here? In the park? Well, there's nobody around but us. And even if there is, I'll show you how fast I can pick your ukulele up. So, are you in? Well, okay. That's the spirit. Can we hear the ukulele? Yeah! Tyrakin was reluctant at first, but after that his first... What? Was reluctant at first, but after that his tune was getting better and better. We said we were doing one song, but we ended up doing many, many more. It was so much fun, I didn't really count. I'm glad he shared his story with me today, and I'm glad I could help him. This time, I'm sure he'll be fine. And the music club performance for this year's cultural event will be just fine. But I'll forget about that for now. Right now, I want to enjoy this moment with Tyrakin. Good end. Yay! Hurrah! Excellent. Well, that was fun and interesting. There seem to be other endings. Uh, if you feel like trying them out for yourself, it's a browser-based game, so you can, there's no download or anything like that. But you can download it if you want to. There's also a link down there to uh, download that. Uh, so yeah, just if you want to play this game for yourself, go down to the description of the video and go right ahead. Um, I have a feeling that there might be an ending where we get eaten by Tyrakum. Just a feeling. Just a feeling. Anyway. Thanks so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please remember to leave a like, favorite, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more. I don't know if I'm going to do more games, uh, ah, simulation games like this, 
because I don't have any others. Uh, yeah. Well, there's always Germanical Murder. I think that counts. Yeah. I'm gonna go now. Bye, guys!